Understanding the basic features and functions on your NAS can upgrade your experience and help you get the most out of it. In this video, you will learn how to navigate through the dashboard and user interface features. Let's begin by opening up the QTS and logging in with the admin user. The first thing you should navigate towards is the dashboard, which is located in the upper right hand corner. It includes all the basic information about your system status, usage, storage, tasks, and news. You can drag any dashboard section over and leave it in the background running. Let's continue with the resource monitor in the background so you can see how it runs. Next, you should direct yourself to the system status page by opening up the control panel, going to system settings, then clicking on system status. Your system status includes all the information about your NAS, such as your NAS model, server, CPU, memory, and serial number. You can also access in detail the network status, which shows your network settings, the system service, which is an overview of which services are enabled or disabled, hardware information, which includes all the basic hardware information and temperature of the system, CPU, and hard drives, and resource monitor, which shows you the live data usage for CPU, memory, disk usage for each section, and bandwidth. You will also be able to view the process along with the disk performance. System logs are also accessed through system settings. System event logs are a record of all system events or error messages that you'll be able to view, clear, or save. Other log features include system connection logs, viewing details of online users, and using syslog client management to save the event logs and connection logs to a remote syslog server. If you want to learn more about your NAS, be sure to check out our other videos. Thank you for watching!